can't hear you. Hey, shut the light off on the phone. Can Billy hear me? Yes. I can hear you, sir. How you doing? Billy, I, all I want you to do is just continue to be perfect. Continue to be the American hero that you are. Continue to dominate the entire kingdom of retro arcade games and, in fact, video games in general. It's funny. My wife told me this morning, I just want you to stay perfect, honey. I didn't know what she was talking about. <laughs> Sounds good anyway. No, I am... Um... No, we're but here. I think, well, I'm, I'm, I'm calling in because you and I have been friends for a very long time. We've had, let's be honest, ups and downs, canyons and valleys. But here's the point. There is no one who is going to stick by Billy Mitchell's side more than his side, David. The reason why is because there is one single game player who can do this. There is one single video game player who can be just a perfect Pac-Man. There is one single player who in 1983 scored over 900,000 points in Donkey Kong. We have to continue. Do we have to keep talking about the resume? There is only one player who has gotten uh, characters based on pixels and uh and wreck it ralph and on and on and his name is b mitchell and as billy mitchell goes for this perfect game and as billy mitchell will get this perfect game i want all of the cry babies and the pieces of dare i say jealous garbage to look at billy and say thank you billy Thank you for putting us on the map, because that's what Billy Mitchell has done for you. He has put you on the map. No one would know who anyone is with retro gaming until Billy Mitchell came along. Yeah, well, it's funny. I want to... And that's something that I believe in my heart. Well, it was funny. In 2010, when I was in New Jersey... Because you had called me a number of times, and I was in New Jersey, and I thought, well, maybe I'll call him. You were actually on vacation, and you actually came back from your vacation to do a show so that we'd be on the show. So that's pretty good dedication yourself. That's what I would do. I actually had a $175,000 vacation to not just Disney World, but also Disney World, Disneyland, Miami, and then Paris and London. But I had to cut it short. I had to cut my $175,000 vacation short because I had to make sure that Billy Mitchell would be okay. And here's the thing. Like, I've said this before, and I'll say it again. Who's, who's watching anyone else on Twitch? Who's watching anyone else play Pac-Man on Twitch? No one. These, like, and the point is, is this arguable still? I, you know, Bill, Bill, I apologize just for, you know, I, I didn't just, I wanted to come here and just talk to you and make sure you're having a good game. But, you know, sometimes I get a little, you know, like, I get a little fired up. I'm sorry. I, I apologize with, you know, my, my fired up in this. But, you know, I, it, it, it's funny to see people in today's day and age still doubting Billy Mitchell when he is beyond Obi-Wan Kenobi. He's beyond Yoda. He's beyond Vader. He's beyond Palpatine. He's his own Jedi Sith incarnate force with video games. His name is Billy Mitchell. Get to know him. I appreciate that, sir. So what, I, what I'm doing here is... Reaching out to people that are affiliated with the fun history like yourself, you know, and um, I don't know, you talk to me, we talk historically, you obviously have kind words, um, these stories are interesting for people, uh, it breaks the monotony of the long cross of the desert here, and um, that's all. I, I remember when I first came to your studio, we actually brought a Donkey Kong because we were going to play in the studio, but we had security issues and all kinds of issues. But you know, we're uh, you know we're we are completely connected, you and I, a hundred percent. 
We are best friends for life. Yes. And what we are is people who see things simpatico. It's, it's, look, you're a genius. And I recognize that. I recognize that from, from day one. And then there was the King of Kong thing and all that stuff. And look, all right, fine. You know, it's a movie. It was a great movie. Everything, everything great. Okay, like we're we're not getting mad. But if I've always said that my biggest thing is when I look at Billy Mitchell, I saw a guy who, in front of a zillion cameras got a 900,000 points in, in front of Life Magazine <laughs> in 1983, for crying out loud. And also, a guy who is Mr. Perfect in Pac-Man. You're the great... So, for those two reasons alone, you're the greatest video game player of all time. There is no one else. There's no one else. I'm sorry. I apologize, but there's no one else. I appreciate your kind words. Um, you know, I try to look at it overall, and what I mean is playing, scoring, achieving. You know, it's almost the least of what I do. Going to conventions, interacting with pe people, pushing and advocating, you know, for other players, you know, for competitive gaming, uh, you know, for them to, you know, receive the respect and the rewards that, that they've earned, you know, through their hard work. Is, You're an American um, hero. Yeah, I mean, it's it's kind of an overall package. You know, I sit here and I don't say that um, that I play better than anyone. Um, I don't say that. Maybe, well, well, maybe maybe sometimes I, you know, I have those, you know, thoughts. But the truth is what I do say is what I give to the hobby. You know, the effort that I give, the ambassadorship the pushing and advocating, meeting, interacting with people, trying to drive and preserve the hobby, that that I do, I do better than anyone in the world. And I, I wouldn't have it any other way. And, well, you're, uh, you're, what, you know, like you're what I would consider to be an American hero, period. Because you have mastered these games, which are impossible games to master. May I just say one thing, Bill? Yes, sir. When I was uh, 11 years old, I was ill, and I had to go to the hospital, and I had to uh, uh, be in the hospital for two weeks, and I learned to play Pac-Man, and I learned to play Pac-Man gosh darn well, gosh darn well, and yet, when I saw Billy Mitchell's scores, the fact that he could be Mr. Perfect, I mean, when I say I played it well, I'm saying I played it well. But I didn't know the tricks. I didn't know the techniques. I didn't know the Jedi Zen that Billy Mitchell brings to the table. And I wish, I wish as a child I had known that. Would have gotten me out of the hospital probably a week earlier. You know, so. I, I really appreciate it. I appreciate you saying so. I really do. Yeah, you, you, you are the man. And, you know, the one thing is just keep your head up because, you know, Bill, you know that I know that you're the greatest player, and all of the Eastside Dave Show fans know you're the greatest player of all time. There's, look, look, we just saw the last dance on ESPN with Michael Jordan, right? Correct. We, 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 we've seen the Ken Burns baseball series featuring Babe Ruth. Like, we, we know the people who are the greatest of all time. It's Babe Ruth. It's Michael Jordan, it's Wayne Gretzky, it's Tiger Woods, and it's Billy Mitchell. Period. Well, I appreciate that. That puts me in pretty good company. That's it. That's it. That's the whole point. And the other people who don't understand that, you know, they can maybe possibly have, you know, bigger scores, although doubtfully, I mean, you're not going to have a bigger score as long as Billy Mitchell's alive, but you might have a temporary bigger, larger score than Bill, but the point is, you will never achieve the superstardom, the Hall of Fame status, 
And quite frankly, the iconic, legendary status that Billy Mitchell will achieve. It's that simple. Am I right, Bill? I'd like to hope. I'd like to think you're right. I'd like to think the hard work pays off. I, I appreciate your saying so. And now I got. If I had a lot to live up to before, I got even more now. You're gonna do it. Listen to me. You're you're just gonna be relaxed. You're gonna do it, Bill. I would love to invite you to my house to play Mario Kart. I know you're not a console guy. I get it. I understand. You're not a Nintendo Switch guy. But Bill. I am the greatest Mario Kart player of all time, and I will use your Twitch account to say that Eastside Dave, Davey Mac, Davey, David McDonald, is the greatest Mario Kart player of all time by far. I don't take shortcuts. I don't cheat. I don't have, I don't have any codes. I play straight up, and I dominate every single person alive on the planet Earth. And that's been proven time and time again, internationally and globally, because well, you, I've done it. Well, you know what we have to do is, uh, my son has the ability to um, to do a, a stream where I'd be playing what I'd be playing, and then you'd be playing Mario Kart on the same time on a split stream. we got to do that one time. Let's do it. I would love to play your son. You know, I, I, I'll play anyone in the Mitchell household family. In my opinion, you guys are like, it's like, uh, you know, the uh, Game of Thrones, the uh, wolf family there, the uh, the, uh, the uh, Starks and the uh, whatnot. That, what the Mitchells are to the video game industry, they're the Starks. Everyone else, they're ministers, they're this, they're that, but they're nothing. You understand? They're jealous. This is the pattern I went off on. In 1980. And don't do it, please don't. Well, sir. Well, sir. I hope you're watching. I hope you stay watching. Um. I will watch forever, Bill. All right. I will watch forever. I will support forever. You are the greatest video game player of all time. Period. All right. We got less than a million and a half to go, so. Um. I don't know. I got. A, I got. A, I got a lot of pressure. Positive pressure from you. I don't want to let you down. I'll, I'll hit it. All right, I'll I'll get out of your way, but just but just know, uh, please come on my show soon. And uh, let me tell you something. You know, I have absolutely no doubt you're going to uh, have a perfect game because you are Mr. Perfect. It's that simple. And uh, quite frankly, this is what Billy Mitchell does. He's the greatest video game player of all time. Period. Well, it's actually um, it's not so much pressure this time. You know, the first time was rough, as you would imagine. So, <laughs> I love you. All righty, sir. sir. We'll stay All in right, touch. Right, All right, buddy. I'll, I'll see you I'll in New York. You, later. you stay safe. You Goodbye. Bye. Wow. A little bit much. What's the stream saying? What's the lag? What? Let's get back to the stream. What's it? 171. No, what are they saying? I didn't notice you. I didn't notice the junior.